mean, we could actually turn turn order on. Right. Okay, let's try this uh, once again, everybody. Apparently, there is something going on with the HB servers right now that is not allowing us to party up in-game. So, what we are going to do is I'm going to go stroke here. Everything was default, right, Scob? I had the wind at medium, but I just set it for default the second time around, so... Okay. So we are each going to just play solo. And I will see if I can get Scob and Dan on Ghost Ball. And we'll go from and there. We, yeah, and then what we should try to do is after we do this, then see if maybe HV servers are back up and running. And then before we start the next one, try to get a yeah. party match in. And if it doesn't work, then same thing with the other one. Yeah. Well, thanks, j -Dub. It's kind of unfortunate because now we've pretty much lost all our uh, all our viewership because of freaking HB servers. I might have been adult here and not selected back nine. There we go. That's right. I can't. I can't find either of you on the ghost anyway. So. Well, I haven't gotten to the T yet. Yeah. It's still loading for me. That's their E3 announcement. We're going to screw everybody who's currently playing TGC 19. <laughs> now that would be an HP move. It's add rival, right? Not add ghost. Oh, I did yeah. start it on back nine, yeah. Alright, so. Oh, I'm not seeing you or Dan yet. Oh, I yep, just got to the T. Oh, yeah, now you're in. Now you're in the game, I see. I will add rival. Not showing me you guys in the game via live ghost. Nope. I don't no. I don't see you guys. I'll just hit my tee shot here and see what we'll go from there. I'm uh, not quite sure, Ash. We haven't heard from him in a bit, so. There, I see you guys all now. We certainly hope uh, TK is doing well and okay wherever he's at. I still can't see you guys. Yeah, I can't see him either. Oh, now you just randomly appeared on my screen here. Let's see. Yep, not in for a ghost, not in for a rival. And now I see you on the T. Yeah, ain't showing up on my screen, guys. <sighs> HB. HB. Oi. That's alright, maybe I won't bogey this hole this time. But yeah, we'll, we'll figure out a way to cobble through this, you guys. Don't you worry, we'll get these courses played tonight. Mainly because I don't have any other time the rest of the week to do this. Alright. So where are you guys at right now on the course? I just made par on 10. I'm on 11T. Oh crap, hold on a second, I got turn order on. Hold on a second, give me a second. Well, I would turn on turn our order if I could actually see you guys in game, but I can't. Uh, try this again. Add rival. I just part. 
Number 10. Again, nothing there. Nothing there. Well, I guess we know who's causing the problem then, don't we? Why, you can see me? Yeah. But then again, you just randomly showed up on my screen. I didn't at you. <laughs> Edge Bay. Bye, Rob. Pay the bills. Now, let's now, see if I your, the party. now I just get your invitation again. <laughs> let's try that. No, I just sent it again. Let's see if it lets you join. Well, here goes nothing. This will cure us or kill us. An unexpected error has occurred. Oh, joy. Let's see. So now if I go to group, we'll see. Nope. Just showing me, myself, and I. Uh, this is not frustrating at all. And I was so winning at skins too. That that's the disappointment. Well you couldn't lose, that was for sure. Yes, that was accurate. if I can all right will you show up this time oh I swear like everybody but you are showing up right now it's so frustrating yeah. Then I'd lo close out. And... Oh, what a mess. Yeah, let's muddle through. I at least get this back nine showed off for, uh... For Danny, and, uh... Yeah, we'll see if we can cobble something together for, uh... for the loops here. By the way, I'm even par through through 12. Par, par, par. I'm giving myself this putt. You guys? Yeah, I'm even par through 12. I'm one under second. through 13. Through 15? 13. Four, 13, 13. Okay, I'm like, Christ, speed golfing it, how about it? I'm hitting my second shot into 13 right now. I just wrapped up my tee shot. You gonna, oh, I don't even need the scab special, I don't think. No. Cause I hit one iron in the, into the green. My two iron is going to come off the front edge. Well, again, guys, sorry for uh, a bit of technical mishap here. Not quite sure what the deal is, but uh, we are muddling through the remainder of Tall Grass Golf Club. Ooh, how about this? How about in? Nestled up for a tap and birdie on 13. 14's a cool looking part three. Well, we're 
about to see that now on stream. Oh, huh? yeah. And then 15's got a Susquehanna pin. Nice. See, you should play this course, get some practice for the U.S. Open. <laughs> See if we can get another one here. Nope. Never high enough. So I'm still one under after 15 or whatever hole that was. The par 3 was 14. 14. And I am okay. also one under. I birdied 15, so I'm not two under. You birdied 15 with the sus pin? Yep. Nice. Well, it's not quite a sus pin because it's got the, uh, it's a softer landing area. <clears throat> oh, good it made, lucky. It made a there bendy like 15 footer. Boom. Green to 40 footer on 16. Oh, yeah, you couldn't fire at that pin on 15, could you? That was, uh. That was interesting. I if I just bogeyed that hole, 15. Fall the even again. And it looks like I'm going to nestle up for a two-putt par. There we go. Yeah, oh, it's weird. I can't recall uh, us having issues quite like that before. Yeah. Well, we thought 11 was a slalom fairway? <laughs> right. Yeah, 16. Or 10, rather? Forget six snow cut. This is like what? Three hard this left. Like a, this is probably like a, a two left, two left into a two right. Ooh, slow back swing, but I got away with it. I just love that. Probably nobody has any idea what we're talking about. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's because none of us have streamed any dirt rally lately. Yeah, be, be aware, Dan. New update's coming out. It's going to be, uh, they're adding oh, clubs out. like leads. So, and it's cross-platform, so you can compete against everybody in, uh, in all the, all the, uh, versions, whether it's Xbox, PC, or PlayStation 4, if you join the league. Boom. I just made a downhill left to rider for birdie on 16. Mine was only 8 right, feet away, in, though. I'm in the clubhouse at 4 under. So That's I got a birdie. birdie. I got a birdie birdie here. In other words, is what you're saying. I'm not going to win it. So I don't matter. Because I'm right now even the two holes left. I just hit a perfect fast. What the hell? Well, I gave it a hey, run. Hey. Landed on the top shelf and went to the back of the green on 17. Boom. Made the 26-footer coming back. I got a chance. All right, you're the last hole, too. I'm three under coming to the last. Try to leave myself a full number in here. I might not have done that anyway with two wood. Nope. 
did not leave myself a full number in. I have failed. You have crossed to the dark side. Uh, my pitch didn't get up. Crap. So I gotta chip this in to tie ya. Did not get there. Alright, an even par. I am gonna be three, assuming I brush this one in. And I did. Well, a little well, more fun. discombobbled than I would have hoped, but that's uh, Tall Grass Golf Club by Sharky21. Danny Skirts. Oh, let's see if this is working now. Yeah, let's see if. Uh, Problem is, if I if I reboot the game, it kicks off the broadcast too. So, all right, invitation sent. Joining. Nope. I'm sorry. We're sorry, but an unexpected error has occurred. Yeah. All right. Well. Okay, J Dub. He literally just published the Loop CC Tour. So, do you want us to play the regular or the tour version? He wants us to play the tour version, so, okay. Alright, so... Ask me if there's a particular set of pins he wants to try. Well, I'm sure he just heard you, Scott. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Is there a particular set of pins you want to try out there, uh, <laughs> JW? He said last leg's really the only change. Uh, he said pins three and four are harder. One and two are easier. Hey, let's go four. Okay, let's, let's go four. That's what I was going to say. Let's go to the four. Yeah. Um. You know, I don't know about you, but I don't have the tour version up yet. Which I supposed if yeah. you just published, and you're on PC, aren't you? Aren't you, Wes? It's Bay. Yeah, see if I, I got, got it here. All I got is the Loops Country Club. I don't have... Yeah. Oh, Xbox One. Either way, not on the platform we are. Well, yeah, that's right. You are on the Xbox One. Bless you, son. Yeah. Oh, that's all right. We'll play the regular version. Uh, let's set everything default except medium wind speed. Yeah, that'll work. Tips and four. Seven, seventeen, and nine. Okay. Live ghosts. Alright. Well, I'm heading to the T right now, guys. Yep. Oh my. See if we can actually get our get our live rivals to sync up here. Oh, you know, I wonder. Because I, I think I turned off a. Uh, Arrival setting. Yeah, let me. Ch oh, <laughs> I'm gonna have to quit out anyway. I set set it for the back nine. <laughs> Oops. Let's wait on the T form there, Dan. God damn it, matey. Yeah, we want to play all eighteen. Get 
back to the medium wind speeds. Alright, the cob is showing for me, which is a good sign, because he didn't do that before. Tips and four. Alright. Take two. Alright, if we get this to work, I'm on the T. I'm sitting here on the T. Well, oh, actually, hold yeah. on. I am going to try to join your round. I right, now show you. But I now have both of you in my game. Uh, let's see. Arrival. Hey, there's a scob. All right. We've done it. We've done it, Martha. Alright, so I have catcher and... Uh, just make sure I should... Yep, my turn order is set to on. Alright. My turn order is set to on. Oh, sit down. Hit a Buick. Mm -hmm. Well, this is kind of the uh, gerrymandered way of doing it, but uh, <laughs> hey, at least you got all three of us on screen, so we're making progress. Pop up my scorecard. Okay, now I got. Now I have Dan. Well, I, I didn't. You guys didn't pop up my scorecard until after I hit off. Yeah, you have. You have to yeah. hit up the first tee before it shows up. Ooh, it almost clipped the tree there, Scob. Yeah, almost. Yeah. The only thing is you guys can't give away spoilers because they're not going to see it until it's on my screen. <laughs> Dan Dan with his second shot in. Just left of the pen. Oh, that's, that's beauty. Tasty. Nestles it to about four feet. I'm sitting here waiting for Jeremy to swing off the tee. <laughs> well, I've already hit off the tee. I'm about to hit my second out of the light rough here. What the hell? 174 in. That's about all I could do out of that lie. Wow, that is a nice shot there, damn damn catcher man. Thank you. So now we're waiting on Scob. Best drive of three, 147 in. Was that a slow? I pushed it. No, okay. I just pushed it. Oh, you got pretty much a stock chip, though. This is mate. Did you take something off of that? No. Just checked up on you? Yep. Could make the chippy. So Dan's going to get one up on us off the start. So I'm assuming he's going to brush this one in. Yep. Dead center. <laughs> now I have two maydays on my screen. <laughs> That's too, too many. Believe me. Oh, having one Mayday in the there's a bush. Better. Pretty looking second hole here. Oh, come up short. Short Dan length. safely finds the putting surface. Pin high about 15 feet. Yeah, who knows who that with... Uh, 
with the lonkiness we're experiencing right now, I, who knows? I blame HB. And I took the aggressive line and ended up on the back edge. And what a surprise. Scob's the only one who missed the green. Yeah, I come up short. Again, what a surprise. That wasn't high enough, was it? Never high enough. Good old double breaker here. Good putt at it, though. It's close, huh? Looks like we're all going to walk off with par on this hole. I mean, I safely can assume Dan's going to make that one. You think? Hey, you I could, don't know. You, you could probably two putt from there. What, no way to shortcut this one? Well, I couldn't find one. Yeah, you might have been able to drive it through the chute, but it'd have been tight. I welcome you to give it a try. <sighs> yeah, nothing ventured, nothing gained. I pushed it. Hit a Buick. Hit something. Hit a Buick. <laughs> yeah, I think actually if I'd have had a good swing line there, that, that would have carried. I think I'd have made it. Yeah, I mean, we virtually got no wind right now, so... Yeah. So I'm assuming, because I think I'm playing the round that Dan set up, so I'm assuming he set it to default. No, I set it to medium. Yeah. Yeah, mine was, like I said, I had a one mile an hour wind off the tee. Oh, now I I've got six. Now I've got seven. Both find the back edge of the green. And let's see how I can do out of the hay here. I won't get up there. Got denied by the little turtleback false front there. Being sad. That's cool. Wes and Houdat, they are playing together on Ghost Ball on Xbox One as we play along. It's always something you can do too if you want. You can 
get the multi-screen experience going. Watch us on your your laptop or your mobile device. Get the gaming console of your choice fired up and play along with us. Always encouraged. More courses these these guys get the or more plays these guys get the better. They're diamonds in the rough for the reason, kind of either newer designers or under the radar guys or definitely deserve the plays, definitely deserve the love. I do apologize. Yeah, what, what you hear in my people in the background? On Facebook about was uh, it? not being able to connect. People are posting on the Facebook groups about not being able to connect on the PS4 right now, so it's not just us. In the golf club or just in general? Yeah. No, in the golf club. Okay. So once again, I go back to... You have to blame HP. It can't be a Sony network because if it was, exactly. it'd be like not talking. Well, exactly. I'm always, I'm already done through five, so I'm waiting for you guys to catch up. <laughs> what, did you turn off turn order? Or? Yeah. <laughs> God damn it, Scob. God damn it, Scob. I want to hear the after the fact commentary. Wow, Scob almost made a sixty, almost made a sixty foot putt. <laughs> Two feet uphill. <laughs> Spoiler, he misses this putt. That's alright, I just put it in the bunker. That's a tough pin to get back at. Yeah. I know that's unfortunate that uh but again total HP move on the on the first day of E3 their their servers have issues. Total HP move. Oh, I will get up and down for Birdie. So guess what? The 60-footer doesn't go in. Because Scob already told us. Even though we said no spoilers. God damn it, Scob. Dan Dan's got a similar putt here. Maybe a little more right to left in it. No spoilers. Well, I wouldn't spoil that either when you leave it six foot short. Uh. <laughs> not something you exact okay seven feet either way not something to brag about and by the way since we are in the uh, 10 o'clock hour Eastern we are less than uh, 24 hours away from another uh, quiplash party aren't we Dan yeah Tomorrow night, 10 Eastern, 9 Central, over on Dan Dan's ca channel, Catcher Band 22. Do three ro rounds of Quiplash on the Jackbox Party. One round anything goes, one round TGC only answers, and one round non-TGC answers. We get some real doozies Ooh. in there, and uh, always a fun time. Oh, have fun with that one. Yes, uh, yeah, that ought to be fun. Uh, okay. Okay, Wes, I get what you've tried to do here. Try to make this tempting little shortcut. I think and I think Dan's ball is exhibit A. 
I think I would have almost done without this little group of four pines right here. Yeah. Because, I mean, now he's just in jail. And he wasn't trying to hit the aggressive shot there. He was actually trying to play the safe shot out to the right. And it just kind of kicked and rolled left on him and kind of kind of rolled into jail. So, I mean, that almost, that, that feels a little bit like double punishment. I mean, I'm fine with these four on the left here. Especially because, I mean, if you try the aggressive line and you push it slightly, then, yeah, I, I don't have a problem being in jail. But, I mean, Dan tried to hit the safe play and didn't really execute all that poorly. And he's got no shot. So that would be my, my critique on that, that tee shot there. Maybe it's a good thing that Scott did play ahead. <laughs> so he already hit that shot without having to wait wait on my rant. <laughs> uh. But yeah, you're gonna have to hit like a very fast duck but duck hook there. Uh. I mean, I suppose the pins. Ah. Yeah, but it's totally blocked. Yeah, you're definitely gonna have to hit a draw, but I mean, yeah. I mean at least blocked. at least at least you're not uh, at least pin isn't back left. I mean, you can do something from there at least. Yeah, I'm sure I can hit the tree and put it right in the bunker. Was that a spoiler? <laughs> no. No, you just predicted my shot. <laughs> yeah, you said you didn't hit the tree. Scob shot here. Look at this. It's a stiffy. Scob has a stiffy? Okay, let <laughs> Alright, here we go. Caught the tree. There's the bunker. Yeah, you just had you had, had, you had to hit a yeah. you had to hit a Big old, big old draw swinging around there. That was about your only chance. Not a bad out though. Yeah, I'll take it. It's a par. Screw it. I'm doing this. This is happening. A little chippy out of the bunker. Oh, and I very slowed it. God damn it, HB. God damn it, Scob. Oh! And then a TGC1 lip out. Oh. <laughs> Crashes on the high lip and stays out. So earlier in the stream when Greg Fordyce said take your time and... Uh, you know, fix some of these things. That's been in the game since one. Let's fix that. Roll over the high side and crash out of the hole. Okay. Oh, narrow little shoot here. Kind of like the look, though, how the bunkers kind of peek through there. Yep. Yeah. Very clean course, that's for sure. Uh, okay. Oh yeah, this is a par five. Oh. I'm gonna take a second to look what he did it back at that bridge. That was actually kind of, kind of neat what I saw.
creative little use of the bridge there. And then I slowed it. Get lucky. But if, yeah, if West, the the I was about to say though, if West is saying we have to hit a big cut here. Yeah, look at this shit. Look, wait, watch this. Look at this. Through, oh, oh, jeez. <laughs> what? <wow. laughs> Catches the pine ball and lands like a butterfly with sore feet. My goodness. Oh, j right in the See this transition? That, that, that's something I'd fix. Just flatten that out right there. Yep. All right, so we got to play a big old Cutosaurus in here. About like that. Too much? Oh, I nearly got the bounce off the knoll, though. Oh, what a hill. Yeah. There, my wife is now done training for her 5K for the night. She's not throwing brooms down the stairs anymore? No. She realized I was wearing a helmet and it wasn't going to do any good. Now there, we'll get the shot back. We'll drop the last. Fun little putt you got here. Wow, it looked like you barely tapped that one considering how far uphill it was. Yeah, I didn't get it there. Well, we saw that. Scott makes a putt. Nice up and down. I think Scott's already finished with his round. Probably. What? No, he he's doesn't say us. anything. He's probably he's probably playing dirt rally right now. How much you want to bet? Oh, he's completely. I mean, he's probably like fell asleep or something. <laughs> Scab, wake up! I forgot I was uh I was using the I was using the pot and I forgot that I muted because I didn't want to stream on stream oh. and I forgot to turn you guys back on. <laughs> God damn it, Scob. This looks like another one you gotta hit a big cut into. Scob took the direct line and it's still rolling. I'm gonna yeah. take the aggressive line here. Well, that is aggressive. And deep. Yeah, he's saying pin. There's a back step back there, though. Ooh, that's coming back. Coming back. Oh, this is getting better by the second. That is well played. Alright. Very slow, cripes. Get lucky. I'm tree. in scob territory. I am in a bush. I feel like we're playing the. Or I feel like we're playing TGC two. <laughs> like it used to play, you know, with the multiplayer. Uh huh. Yeah, it is kind of like that, ain't it? Oh, oh. 
<laughs> F you, ball. F. Oh, are you coming down? F you, JW. What? Burn oh, yeah, emojis for everybody. Wow. Dan's eleven feet. Why is it showing his? Oh, goodbye, Dan. Uh, burns the edge. Well, it would be the first time that in this uh, show that someone had streamed on stream. That's true. Jakesy did a little drive-by <laughs> in one of the early episodes. There's a time that TK had to hit the head and Scob let out a two cheek sneak and tried to blame it on him. <laughs> I almost bought it too for a second there. Like, wait, what? Did you not? Oh, god damn it, Scob. And Chris was like, oh, don't you fucking blame me. <laughs> that was hilarious. That was the uh, diamond cutters moment of the year. Mm -hmm. hmm, split decision here on eight. For some reason, that view almost has a little bit of a Stanley Thompson feel to it. Maybe it's just because we're playing on such right. know, a mountainous setting, but it's like if the bunkers were a little more wild, it definitely felt, felt like a Stanley Thompson course. At least that shot. So you guys aren't wanting to try the bottom, huh? I'll bite. We'll have to see. I'm not sure what I think about that pine right there. In f right at the corner. Yeah, I Game suppose there's... All, David Hasselhoff. <laughs> <laughs> I, mean, I suppose tip. there's a strategic ele element, but... You have no chance of hitting it. That sounds like a challenge. <laughs> right? Challenge accepted. Get up. Or not. No chance of hitting it, but aesthetically, I don't know if I need that tree there. You know, I, I think I think the look might be just as good, maybe a fuzz better without it. Nice shot there.
Yep, that's good. Right, that's fair. Oh, you totally hit 50 yards of water in real life. <laughs> Pop it right in the water. I, I know, but I get in this game. I mean, you're never yeah, gonna. Yeah. I mean, you're never gonna hit hit it in the water or all those little short cross hazard ponds. I mean, I, I get that. But... Hmm, did I pull ahead of Dan? Yes, I did. is in the house. Good evening. Welcome to the second course of the night on the Diamond Cutters, the Loop Country Club. Mayday, Dan Dan, Scob here. Uh, a bit of a dilapidated version. We are playing Ghost Balls uh, tonight because uh, apparently HB servers are not allowing for legitimate in-game parties right now. At least on the PS4. Thanks, HB. That's all right. It takes a lot more than some HB servers to to slow our roll. We got this figured. It's all right. I sat there Friday and I played every single daily of the uh, of the Dirt Rally dailies. Every single one. I think it was like five of them. And usually the the next day it says rewards available. I get there Saturday morning. No rewards. No rewards. No rewards for you. Go onto the forum and say, yeah, I've got no rewards. Went there this morning, up, oh, didn't get any rewards for dailies on Saturday either. <laughs> like, oh, that's good. But I'm at like just under 2 million credits, even though I just bought another another car today. Oh, well, I don't have that many credits. Just go to Fabia Rally. I keep buying cars to compete in the dailies. <laughs> oh, yeah. What's cool though is like with the dailies, if you see the ones with the red promo on it, you don't even have to have the DLC, you can still run those. So I don't know if you've tried to run the... Uh... Oh, Scob Special, did we get up there? Not quite. If you've tried it... to run Sweden yet with the snow, all the snow no. banks. <laughs> yeah, I see what you mean there, J-Dub. Just a slight bit of choppiness up by the green. Not terrible. It was 17 where people were reporting all the choppiness anyway, so I'm curious to see what we get. Oh, well, Jeremy went Scob special. Why not Scob go Scob special? Depends, what's your lie? Like, gotta land in short? <laughs> like, way short? <laughs> like, in some white things in the front? Shandy Beaches. This is, uh, the Loops Country Club by, uh, JW Texan. This is his third course, if I'm not mistaken. Second, right? I think it's the second course. I thought he had one more out there. Aside I thought from Castle this. was his, yeah, was his first. Yeah, Tamalin yeah, was the second, his, the second course. Okay. Scob, right in the middle of the bunker. But either way, uh, very nice track this. Just need another foot. I got your foot right here. Ah. Well, I hate to do this to you guys, but since we're not playing for skins, I need to back out here to turn. Okay. The wife needs me. No worries. Well, thank you for joining us for as long as you have. Yeah. 
putting up with our technical <laughs> difficulties. Sorry, the uh, HB decided to act up on us. Mm. Oh, look at this putt by Scob! Curling in the side door! Of course, the real reason Dan's taken off is he can't say that Scob beat him then. That's right. Alrighty, boys. I will see you guys later. Mayday, see you tomorrow. Yep. Alright, see you, Dan, Dan. Nine. <laughs> yep. And don't forget, you can catch us on uh, Catch Your Band's channel tomorrow night, 10 o'clock Eastern. So I better go into Nine Central. Get rid of, get rid of Catch Your Man. <laughs> yep, me too. Oh, Grizz making a course for 2019. Nice. Alright, here we go. He is removed. Alright, just you and I, Scob. Like I said, a lot of good stuff coming out lately. Yep. Like I said, I was I was excited for a see a couple of the releases that came out today. I said Grovey's latest uh, Ghost Valley dropped a couple of hours ago. Excited, excited for that one. Danny Vaughn put one out a couple of hours ago. The ruins at Oterra Point. Give, give that a check through. Yeah, a lot of good courses coming out. Oh yeah, no doubt, Grizz, and, and we're. <laughs> And we're kind of in the quote-unquote in the lull between contests right now. I know they're still working on some of the Dream Team courses. I think that deadline's not until August or something. But uh, we're about three weeks from the publishing window open for the uh, the CCDC the Challenge Circuit Design Contest. That window will run July 1st to July 15th. 30 some odd guys in that one myself included and uh Scob you've gotten a sneak peek of uh at least one of the screenshots and what at yep. least uh three and a half cans of sharbage yeah maybe three and three quarters yeah not quite four definitely not five but it's adequate Scare me with a little shot just right to the pin, like yep. really far right to the pin. Yeah. Keep rolling. Well, I was smack in between clubs there. Putting contest. That could never go wrong with the two of us. Nope. Yep, 30 or 24 guys in the Dream Team contest. Ooh, that looks good. Didn't quite hit it, but... Ooh. Oh, Scob! Burned the edge. Oh, man. We did everything but make those putts. We actually knew what the hell, looked like we knew what the hell we were doing. Oh, well, that's not possible. Oh, yeah. Um. Well, it's going to be a little bit of a lull. I, I, unless someone kind of kicks off an informal contest. Uh, because after the, the CC contest, the next official uh, TGC Tours contest is going to be the rookie contest. 
And that one, I think, will kick off mid to late. Uh, well, Grizz has done a lot more than that, but he hasn't. Uh, he hasn't done much in 19. But uh, yeah, the rookie contest comes up in August. I think that runs like mid-August to mid-October, something like that. So the next one after that would be uh, would be the World Cup, which would start in. Uh, I think the green flag would wave on that one in mid-October. Like I said, there's a chance someone could do an informal contest along the way. So uh, always check out the threads on the TGC Tours board. See uh, who's got what cooking up. Oh, and there's a slow. Yeah, in theory. In theory, we should if they're going to do something. Well, that worked out a lot better than it should have. Um, but with E3 going on this week, we uh, if there's going to be a TGC 2020. Uh, we should be finding out right quick. Uh, HB, my understanding, is not there, but 2K Sports is. Look at the, oh! Ooh, burns the edge again. That hung a hard right, right at the edge. So yeah, no, and, and, and until HB announces that there's going to be a new game, I'm, I'm just going to work under the assumption. Got to hit it. That there won't be, but uh, hello, Rude. Hey, what's going on? Yeah, this has kind of been a made aid round. Has not been that good. Oh, which what, the what, fuck? What? <laughs> what I just said, I'm like, what? Huh? He would you fast, fast the putt? <laughs> Apparently, my gosh. That was a made aid moment right there. Crashing and burning. Yeah, but it's downhill, though. And I have to imagine yeah, there's is. a shortcut here. Oh, yeah, 558. The way the crow flies downhill. Wind isn't doing us any favors, though. Scott says, hold my beer. And that is well played. I don't even think you need to fast that, do you? Nope. Oh, I did, though, but no, you don't. Well, you cleared that by a mile. <laughs> yes, they are, Grizz. Tempo roulette is real. Even for us on the quote unquote chosen system, PS4. Which is why you find me on the Beginner Club Tour nowadays. Is this going to be a SCOB special? Uh, I don't know. I, don't, I haven't looked at my shot yet. Uh, well, it's uphill. It's like uphill to the green, so I might. Let's put it this way. Supposedly, uh, the PS4 guys have it the easiest of them all. Um, I know I certainly have struggled to find consistent tempo as of late on, on PS4. Not to the extent... I do have this game on PC as well. And it's not... I, I would say the issue for me on PC is worse... Um, Hellerud, actually, no. 
um, all you gotta do is in your profile on the main website, not the forums, but the main tgctours.com. Um, you just in your profile, you have just gotta change uh, which platform you're you're putting you're playing on, and then make sure you have your correct gamer tag for that platform in there. So like I'm also I'm also made a nine one two eight three on the PC. So when I switch to beginner clubs, because a few of my buddies play it on PC, so I figure I play with them. So I, I just switched my my preferred system to PC and made sure my Steam tag was in there and uh, it went into effect for the next week. Kind of a wonky swing line there, but it's going to get up. Not bad. Mine's over there between the bunkers. Well, I, and granted, I use an older DS4 on the on the PC because I mainly I, I got the PC and I got the game for PC for the Zion end of things. Because it it is loads faster designing on PC than it is X, than it is on console. Wow! Look at that funnel down. That's a shot. But um, yeah, no. Typically, I mean, when I'm not doing my BCT rounds, if I'm just playing casually on PC, I'll I'll use pro clubs. Because Master's just way, way too much tempo. Tempo issues for me. Come on. Oh. Um, I'm trying to remember all the specs on my PC, but... Uh, oh, Jesus Christ! Whoa! Scob! Going OHIO with the horseshoe! Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What's a Buckeye? Oh, it's a Buckeye. <laughs> <laughs> Somehow I'm not upset by that. On Wisconsin. But, um, no, I, I would say, I mean, my, my rig definitely isn't high, you know, and, you know, it's not low end, but it's not high end either. But it, it runs just fine on mine. Okay, 13 is drivable, J-Dub says. Ugh, gonna need about a perfect shot to do it, though. Well, looks like it is gonna looks like it's gonna go seven games because Boston is up four to one. <laughs> of course, it was gonna go seven games, and we made it. Ooh, I thought you hit that tree. Oh, you hit that tree too, though, right? That's not gonna be a fun little chip, though. Yeah, let me see. There was, gosh, and I'll see if I can try to find it somewhere, but you know, a few months ago, there was actually, uh, I can't remember, didn't I share that with, I shared that with you, or you were TK, TK Scott, if I remember right. Shared what? You know, the, 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 the specs? Uh, I, I think it might have been TK. I don't yeah. think it was me. See if I can find it in my, uh. my PMs here. Let me keep looking for this. Oh, what are we going to do? 
to do here? Let's go nine iron. Killing in that bank. Just like that. I'm trying to make a birdie here. Nope. Yep. Uh, oh. Geez. Yeah, I did send it to you, Scub. Okay, Midwhale. Here is the setup on mine. And, yeah, uh, <clears throat> go ahead, finish with mail. And here is. I found this on a post back in October, kind of the kind of the general guidelines. That that I uh, ripped off of Erickson Stone. That should hopefully get you. Somewhere in the... Yeah, I, I did go out Amazon for mine. So I think... You know, with monitor and everything else, I think I was in for about... Uh, 16? I mean, so... You know, it could definitely do some cheap... I mean, like I said, it's kind of middle of the road. But then again, I don't do a ton of other computer gaming other than that, so... I just wanted something that was going to handle this game pretty smoothly and uh, probably handle the next couple of, uh, couple of editions fairly well, too. Not be obsolete in like a year or two. But yeah, I mean, I tell you what, I mean, the difference... And, you know, Grizz is right. I mean, for me, I mean, the... The designer has been much more stable in PS... In the PC, in fact... I'm trying to recall if I've had an actual crash in the designer and PC. And is that coming back? Oh, look at that. Look at that. Yeah, just, oh, that's boy. Why you, that's why you heard me let a sigh out when the ball, like, hit the fringe and then it stopped and I'm like, and then I started to roll back like, mm. wow. <laughs> Scob living dangerously. But yeah, I mean... God, if I've, if I've had a crash in the designer on PC, I can't remember it. Whereas, I mean, blue screens on PS4, I mean, that's kind of... That was kind of an everyday occurrence. You learn to save and save often when you're designing on console. Oh! Dirty double breaker. J-Dub, you are not being friendly to us on these greens. But yeah, I mean, then too, I mean, once you, once you get toward the end of the object meter, eh, fair point. <laughs> Very fair point. Yeah. Oh, pff. Yeah, I mean, I literally, for me, Hobat was my last design on PS4. 
and literally at the end, because I was, I was maxed out on the object meter to the point where I had to, had to take a few things out to add other things in. I mean, I was literally maxed out, and it was easily five to seven seconds from the time click button until the action actually took. It was mind-numbingly slow at the end. Which is part of the reason I'm not on PC. Well, yeah. <laughs> From what I understand, I mean, Xbox guys are pretty much in the exact same boat, so... Yeah. Well, and then, too, I mean, I, I, I think... I mean, that kind of goes and shows... You know, like... My design process is different from, say, how Andre designs. Because Andre's always been a PC guy, and he does everything on one hole, then moves, does everything, on, I mean, the whole shooting match, the sculpting, the planting, da-da-da, and moves hole to hole to hole like that. If you try doing that on console, I mean, by the time you get to 18, I mean, you're just going to be done. By the time you get to 18, you're 18 months in. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. So, I mean, that's why, I mean, I'll do all, I'll lay all, do all my sculpting, lay all my surfaces. I won't touch pl planting until, you know, the holes are, the, sur the surfaces are down and the, and the course is sculpted. Because I know once I start running up that object meter, it's just going to take longer and longer and longer. But now, I mean, now that I'm on PC, though, I mean, I designed the same way because I was, I was used to kind of that process when I designed a course on, on. Yeah, Jada, especially if you're gonna stick with console, I would seri I would strongly consider trying to hold off on the planting until. As late as you can. You're going to save yourself a ton of time in the long run. Why, you got yourself a little swinger here. Indeed. Never high enough. And I, I know, I mean, it, like I said, I mean, each designer is different, too. And. But yeah, at the end of the day, I mean, if, if, if you're going to stick with Xbox for a while, I mean, I would. Especially in a contest setting, it is really going to save you in the long run. And I've said it I don't know how many times, but I mean, part of designing for contests, a, a part that's extremely underrated and not talked about much, if ever, is time management. I mean, yeah, because you think you've got, well, you've got two and a half hours, or two and a half months. I got plenty of time. Next thing you know, it's two weeks to deadline and you haven't even touched the planning yet and you're starting to freak out. And so it's managing your time and having a good plan. So yeah, if you're going to do more contests, I mean, I, that would be my, my personal tip.
Tac. Sounds like a good idea. Well, we fasted it. Keep turning. Or nah. This right club never could get up to that shelf, though. Well, I have the one iron, so I might be able yeah. to. You'll be surprised, J Dub. I mean, Habits and tendencies will change, I think, and I can say that from my own experience. You know, because, I mean, I'll just say, you know, once upon a time, I mean, back in the TG1C1 days, I swore I would never design a course from flat. I just, I, I couldn't wrap my mind around, you know, getting the tools to shape a plot and design like that. You know, about the fifth, sixth course in, I mean, all of a sudden it kind of, I mean, Hoback was from a dead flat plot. It just kind of clicked. Oh, get in. Great shot, Scott. Go, go from the chip shot with the bunker. But, I, I mean, my point there, and it's not the humble brag on Hoback, but, I mean... I mean, the process yes, used is. to... <laughs> but, <laughs> no, I mean, the process used to create that was something, you know, my first few courses in, I would have never considered doing. <clears throat> Sit down, hit a Buick. I need to hit the Empire State Building. <laughs> That's all right, I made the comebacker. Hey, no stock in. So, I mean, I guess my point, my point is, I mean, right now you'll say, oh, I, I, I like doing it this way. And, you know, at some point you'll, you'll try it and, you know, doing something different and it might just work. Well, Scob's running away with this one. And with no Billy Bass opportunity to be had, I think Scob safely got this one of the bag three up with two to play. Water on the right. And then, too, I mean, there, once upon a time, I said I was never going to do a step course, step desert course. Avondale American. Yep. Okay, great shot, by the way, Scob. Okay, I, I did, I did notice a little bit of a stumble there right at the hole, but. Yeah, yeah, it's a little stumble. A little stumble. Not terrible. That was a hell of a shot, Scob. I like, I like fully lofted that club <laughs> to get it to. Oh, and then I slowed it. You're gonna go bunker bound? No. Nope. Right bunker over there? It was pin high. It was the right club if I didn't slow it. Uh, this ain't good. Uh, oh, yeah, because you gotta, like, down, as soon as it hits the green, it goes straight downhill. I am D E D dead. That's about as well as I could have done from there. Yeah. I am actually quite happy with that shot. Yeah, that was a ch touch choppy right of that green, too, but... Nice putt. Thank you. See, I, I don't... I mean, it's definitely enough to be noticeable, but I don't... I don't think it's enough to affect gameplay, if that makes any sense. 
Oh, jeez. As he misses the putt. That was, that was just a terrible read. That had nothing to do with leg. That was just me sucking at this game. I mean, let, let's put it this way. I mean, it's... It's enough that it's noticeable, and if I were playing, you know, like on a, in a tournament, I might think it affected my game. Like I said, it, it might not have actually, by frame rate, you know, really done anything, but it's just enough to kind of shake up the golfer, if that makes any sense. So it might not have actually had a physical effect, but it might have been more of a more of a mental thing. Yeah, slow backswing, of course. But I won't be a bunker. My guess is it's all these rocks that have caused the leg. That would be my presumption. I mean, back on Tantalon, it was the it was the buried trees that did it, but... I mean, that would be my, my guess here, is we got a lot of, like, the studded rock cliff look here, which actually looks really nice, but... Yeah, but hopefully with the newer yeah. chip coming out, because PlayStation, because the uh, PS5 and PS4 are going to be backwards compatible, so if you just, like, stuck with this game on PS5 or PS4 because the PS5 version sucks and you decided to play this on a PS5, it would it's, it's backwards compatible, so it might not be as choppy because it's supposed to have a, a bigger chip in it. In other words, what you're trying to say, I think, is if you played TGC 19 on a PS5, it would be better. Yeah, that's what I was trying to say. Oh, let's see if I can end this, end this hole in a bang. And again, guys, uh, this this is our summer home, if you if you will, our summer time slot. 8.30 Eastern, Sunday night. Scob, myself, whoever else cares to tag along. So we play the Diamond Cutters. Again, unfortunately, HB didn't let us do our traditional uh, skins alt shot format tonight. Really a pity, because I was killing Scob and skins tonight before HB dropped. I mean, it was like the good old days. Good old days without the TK rage. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, we'll do this every Sunday night. Uh, we'll find out Tuesday night on what's going on, what our Diamonds of the Rough for the week will be, and we'll play them on Sunday night right here on my channel. Also, don't forget, I do Sunday Morning Damage, where I play the Dirty Ankle Mafia Society rounds. And... I always pop in on Dan Dan's stream as well. Dan Dan the Catcher Band for Monday Night Quiplash, 10 Eastern, 9 Central. Nice little 65. Yeah. Don't forget on TGC Tours TV, also the admin show on Thursday nights. Also, you got Greg Fordyce and uh, Nobleman Kent doing the TGC Course Review Show. That's on Thursdays and... And Saturdays, as I recall. So, yeah, a lot of great uh, TGC Tours content out there. A lot of great guys who stream it as well. So, definitely a five-star and a favorite out of that. Nice work out of uh, out of West there. And uh, can't wait to see what he's got cooked up for the Dream Team competition. So, Scob, as always, been a pleasure. It was fun while it was working. Yeah. And not so fun after it stopped working. 
Yeah, but we we affected a solution. Yep, sure did. And uh, yeah, so thanks guys for hanging out with us on this Sunday night. We hope you have a pleasant week. It's U.S. Open week. Hope you enjoy both uh, in game and otherwise. The in-game pros taking on Susquehannock this week, and uh, it's playing as tough as expected, at least according to the early returns. So it's going to be very interesting to see how the PGA Tour guys handle our major championship design challenge winner this week. But uh, all right, for Scob and for Dan Dan, who joined us earlier, and for all of you, thanks for joining us. I'm Made A signing off. Have a very pleasant Sunday evening. Goodbye, everyone.